Discuss it. This banger <coughs> is a little dirty. I know all about Q-tipping bangers. There's Q-tips underneath here. I usually do. I just get fucking busy. Sometimes I forget. <coughs> so sometimes it gets dirty. Y'all stop being my fucking mom about it, alright? God damn. I don't think I've heard it. Really? Yeah. Let's see what we can find when we get home. Alright, when the XX. So you never heard of the XX? The hood internet? No. You remember when they did what was the... He would have took these and matched them up. Uh, uh, it's like how DJ, how the modern DJ became digital in my opinion. I was it's DJ. Like I missed the whole thing. <laughs> How's it going? It was good. How are you? Good. good. That's the XX right there. The song? Yeah. That's who that is. Really? I swear to God. We were literally just talking. That's the XX, right? Yes, the intro. Dude, that's great. We were literally, he's never heard of the XX. We were just talking about it in the elevator. It's like, you've never heard of like the XX to the hood. Alright, me out. All right, I gotta go. What the fuck? Dude, welcome. That is fucking crazy. No pee in poop zone. He's a wild animal. And if he has to go to the bathroom, he's gonna go to the bathroom. Sorry. I don't know what world you live in. I don't know what version of The Sims you downloaded this morning, but uh, it's not really how the world works. Hi. Hi. Yeah, that's what it is. Two and a three. Yeah. Oh, one more. Trying to get a treat. Oh, I'm such a crazy little dog. Put that on your dog, like. Yeah. My last dog's name was Doobie, and he was just like the most chill. lazy, chill dog in the world. Yeah. So. Well, have a good day. Hi, you too. The juice spot. Which one did you get? You're in the bag. We just got done Twitch streaming. They got him 70 and 40. Oh. Someone's in his house. Fuck out of my face, fuck son. Yeah. Who the fuck are you sneaking up on, bitch? Damn. What the fuck are you talking to? Damn. Dude, don't even let him get a strap. Get in there. Damn, you shut the door in your face. Now he's strapped up. Where is he? Oh, he's got the crowbar. You're not even pointing at him. What are you doing? You're just hitting buttons. You're just hitting buttons. There you go. No, I'm not. Yeah! I'm jumping. I'm jumping. My dude. Fucking rat, son. I'm making a fucking beat on your shit, son. <laughs> oh! I got the eight. And now, I don't know if anyone or all of you or whoever knows, the uh, Mario Odyssey just dropped last night on Switch. And I don't know what this thing's trying to get me to do. But regardless, we gotta go get pro controllers because we want to play Switch and I want to play it on live stream. We gotta figure all this stuff out. So we gotta go to GameStop. Ready? Yeah, I know. Look at you. Can't see it because you're in the light. Ooh, matching. Too bad they're not yours. For snowboarding? Can be. It's a thrill. Yeah. Shout out to the plug. I got this shit for nothing. I'm son. I can eat all this. <laughs> oh, nice. Damn, son, what you know about Boost chocolates? Oh, oh shit. shit. <laughs> <laughs> the Australian stripper cookie. <laughs> Are you shaking right now? Yeah, dude. I see all that chocolate. I get crazy. All right, on me. Today we're over. Switch. Uh, 
All right. So, kind of a short day today as far as vlog stuff goes. Getting ready for this AI drop on Sunday. Shoe drop that is in a couple of hours. The camera is kind of tilted. Really, really excited about Mario Odyssey. So went and got the controllers for Mario Odyssey. You'll probably be playing that mostly on Twitch for the next couple of days because I've been looking forward to that. Everyone said it's amazing. So I gotta get all that stuff set up. Ern has a friend in town. Chris, we have dinner plans. And just trying to get everything done and in time and uh, keep my life in order. But real quick, I did think we could review the SNS uh, summer con at the back to school pack. I think it's technically called the class of 99. SNS exclusive, so it only released SNS, already released online and in store. That's actually not true. They released tomorrow on SNS. They just did early pairs for certain people. They sent out emails to give people early access and that's what someone gave me. So just to clear that up, they do drop tomorrow if you want. People weren't really going crazy over this. I mean, I woke up and people are offering me these for retail left and right. Uh, ended up picking up both pairs to check out. And I have to say that I am pleasantly surprised and glad that I did. So the colorways, you have a green and white colorway, you know, a more burgundy and gold colorway on the second pair, both pairs together. So these are to rep, the colorways are to represent collegiate teams. It's not, they didn't go specifically which teams. So I guess that's open to interpretation. I do, I don't really know much about green and white in college teams, but I do know that if this shoe released as a sports exclusive, like, you know, Arizona, that people would probably be losing their shit over it. But because there's no, uh, no special marketing attached to it really, other than the class of 99 pack, people didn't really care. So win, win for me. If you want a pair, you probably can get them super close to retail, if not for retail. Uh, so we've reviewed quite a few CS2s. We're gonna look up, here's the shoes together so we don't skip anything. Shoe, shoe, hmm. Mm -hmm. A green pair. This is like a Celtics pair to me. I don't know. I can't for the life of me think of a green and white college team, but I'm like not in the mix with sports in colleges, especially. This is my favorite of the pack. I like both pairs. The colors are super rich and super like just vibrant and very primary looking to me. And I just, I know they're not primary shades, but they're very nice looking. I really, really like them. The one big thing about this CS2, so we've reviewed quite a few CS2s. The main thing people complain about is the brick on the inside hurting their foot, and that's pretty much it. And then the removal of the bricks on the outside. A lot of people like, people like the CS1, which had bricks on the outside. Bricks on the outside. Um, but the CS2, they removed all that, they changed the boost. The boost is real flat in the CS1. CS2, you definitely get much more in the heel area as it slopes down into your foot. It's a much more comfortable fit to me as far as the way the boost fits onto the bottom of your foot or the way that your foot fits on top of the boost rather. So the big difference in this one, the prominent on this pair, on this one and the green pair, is back to this like OG prominent that we got. It's even better than this. Hold on, here we go. Here we go. So it's more like this knitting on the OG NMDs, which is what made me really fall in love with PK NMDs. Even the camo NMDs, you'll like camo NMD. It's much more coarse. Uh, this this is like perfect. It's super buttery. It's super nice, and it really uh, really makes for a great fit. It's like it, it's just it's perfect. These are these are perfect the way they fit. So I really love the fact that the PK on this is back to that original super stretchy, really comfortable PK. Even in like the Ronnie Fogs, which a lot of people hate this shoe. This. You know, when they started to use these different patterns, the knitting changes. I mean, it's just not, it's not as comfortable. It's not as stretchy. It doesn't move with your foot as much. This is perfect. And because of that knit upper, uh, there's absolutely, I don't feel that brick at all. This is super snug on my foot on the top, giving me that boost to foot connection that I think is what makes boost more comfortable than other shoes. So this, these two pairs to me, super glad I picked up and I'm, I'm super hype on them. Uh, so if you don't know, true to size is my suggestion on these. I cannot half size down in this shoe like I can an NMD or CS1. Again, just the way that it's constructed is different on your foot. So for me, true to size, um, obviously with these pairs, upper is one solid color. There's no peppering. You just have this burgundy, red, crimson colorway uh, with the gold stripes. You know, you have the same color stitching all throughout. Half circle stitching on the side, the faux laces on the front, and then of course, NMD tags on the back. Support wise, CS2 is not like an ultra boost. I do think they're a little bit more comfortable than NMDs. It's just a different fit. Again, tighter fit, a little less casual on your foot, I would say. These are perfect, 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 perfect. Uh, so yeah, really happy about these. Uh, no insole, so again, a wooden size down. And then uh, one of my favorite things is the burrito wrap asymmetrical ankle collar. 
I guess, sure. But yeah, so that's the red pair. And then of course, same with the green pair. One solid color, green brick, green, 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 and then white little stripes and white lettering, so. Yeah, that is the SNS class of 99 pack based off collegiate colors going back to school. I don't even know, are people going back to school right now? I guess after Christmas break or something? I don't know. I don't know the I don't know why the timing of this drop was around now, but there they are. All right, so that's it for the day. Uh, I gotta get out of here. I got so much shit to do. Gotta edit this vlog. And then, um, yeah, so we will be back. I'll see you guys Monday. I'll see you on Twitch this weekend. And we'll see you for the drop, which has probably already happened by the time this hits for the shoes. There may be something left. That's at ohitsteddy.com. Stuff will come down quickly um, because we're getting ready for the Sunday drop which is also at osteddy.com. There's a lot of items dropping, so AI, what's dropping is, there's a bunch of stuff dropping on Sunday. I've posted a lot of leaks, and there's just a lot of stuff, but I really quickly, for those of you that are interested, because I keep getting hit up, signature circuit board will drop. There's t-shirts in multiple colors, and also long sleeves, and also hoodies. And they look like that right there. So, the, all of that is dropping. The Artificial Intelligence Violin Player in Pink. So that is dropping in t-shirts, different colors, long sleeves, and hoodies as well. This picture doesn't have the sleeve print on it. They have sleeve prints. You can go over to my Instagram and see the sleeve prints. So, those are all dropping. The Runner, which is the same same thing. Sleeve prints aren't on here. Sleeve prints have been posted. These are just our mock-ups. And there's also a hoodie coming in this as well. but. 
long sleeves, long sleeves, short sleeves, and hoodies. The hoodie is not pictured. There's also lanyards and pins that are dropping, and that's it. It's a pretty big drop, but some things are super limited. Uh, we're trying to kind of broaden things. A lot of people complain about only having black shirts and only having this, so we've had to kind of split things out a little bit. So go after what you want, and then maybe go back if you're looking for other things, because uh, I would expect some things to go very quickly. So, all right, Sunday at 10 a.m. Tonight, 6 p.m., I'm out of here. I feel like I've said this stuff 100 times, but someone will still ask. All right, love you guys. Peace. Oh my God. So it is, it's like seven, a little bit after seven, like 7.30. So the uh, shoe drop, the shoe drop was attempted uh, multiple times just now. Uh, the shoes went live at six the first time. The website was getting botted to shit. Uh, completely crashed. We uh, called we call the servers. We tried, we upgraded the servers to the highest amount that we could. Delayed the drop until seven. It fucking crashed again instantly. There was 25 orders that came through all of Yeezy Zebras, which obviously I only have one pair. There's like, you know, 20 or so pairs of the Calabasas pants sold. So I had to refund all the orders. Everything got refunded. No shoes have been sold. That was insane. So now tonight we're going to work all night and try to shift this site over to a Shopify. We're going to relaunch tomorrow. So tomorrow, It'll be on ohitsteddyshoes.com, completely different website, uh, and it will be at 4 o'clock p.m. Mountain Time. So that's 6 on the East Coast, 3 o'clock uh, in California. I'm really sorry because I know a lot of you plan this and you, you know, have been waiting and you just took like an hour or two out of your night, your Friday night to do this. I'm sure some of you have girlfriends that are yelling at you, wives, children. I'm really sorry. Like, I really tried to make this easy, and I didn't think that it was going to be this fucked up. So, uh, I really hope tomorrow it's a lot easier, and I, I'm just I'm just sorry. Because I know it's really frustrating. Especially you guys who got through and got refunds. Because, yeah, I, I get it. So, hopefully tomorrow everything will be good. I, I'm sure it will. Let's just plan on it. Check my Instagram and my Twitter and any social media to keep up to date. But, 4 o'clock tomorrow. Oh, it's teddyshoes.com. I hope it works out. <laughs> All right, I'm really gonna go for real this time. It's been a night.